Sicilian defense, Tamanov, Vastrykov, English attack, 7, NF6. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game battle was fairly even. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The c pawn in the Sicilian defense controls the d4 square. Nf3 moves the knight toward the center in anticipation of a pawn push on d4, where it will be ready to retake the piece if black captures on d4. The dark squared bishop has a fresh opening created by e6, and the queen has a new diagonal created by e6. d4 offers to trade the more important central d4 pawn for the c5 pawn in exchange for more control of the center and quick development. Cx d4 gives black two central pawns versus one central pawn for white. Nx d4 recaptures the pawn and activates the knight in return for having one central pawn versus black's two central pawns. Nc6 challenges the knight on d4 and controls the e5 square. Nc3 defends the e4 pawn and puts more pressure on the d5 square. Qc7 defends the knight on c6 and controls the important d6 and e5 squares. B3 develops the bishop and defends the knight on d4. A6 sets up the pawn drive at b5 and prevents the white pieces from approaching b5. Qd2 develops the queen, supports the bishop on e3 and prepares queenside castling. Nf6 develops the knight toward the center, attacks the e4 pawn and controls the d5 square. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling queenside tends to be more active because the rook is closer to the center. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the opposite side of the board as the opponent normally leads to a sharp, attacking game. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn and must now move or be captured. This threatens to win a knight. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is the last book move. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This ignores a better way to recapture a piece. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This squanders a chance to link rooks. It is incorrect. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. It is best. This misses a chance to protect a pawn that was being attacked. It is incorrect. This defends a knight who is being attacked and is not well defended. It is ideal. This threatens to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is a mistake. This loses a pawn. This threatens to fork pieces. There was only one good move in that position. This permits the opponent to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is a mistake. This threatens to reveal an attack on a bishop. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This misses an opportunity to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is a miss. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is a great move. Very precise. It is best. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is best. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. There was just one smart move to be made. It is incorrect. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores an opportunity to move a knight to safety. This permits the opponent to kick a bishop. It is a miss backs off. It is ideal. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. There was just one smart move to be made. 
this blows the chance to defend against an assault on a helpless pawn. It is incorrect. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This defends the pawn that was attacked. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. This misses a chance to improve a bishop's square and broaden its range. It is incorrect. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game battle was fairly even.